I'm about to make it easy for you to find the perfect portable monitor for you. In this video, I'm going to simplify dozens of hours of research to help you find what the best portable monitor is going to be for your specific needs. All the links to find the best prices on all the products mentioned in this video will be in the description below. The products mentioned in this video are in no exact order, so be sure to stay tuned till the very end so you don't miss anything. First on my list is the Lenovo ThinkVision M14, my choice for the best portable monitor for most people. The 14 inch display on the ThinkVision is exceptionally crisp and vivid. The panel is an IPS with a native 1080p resolution for a 16 to 9 aspect ratio, providing very sharp images and videos overall, which makes this the perfect tool for videographers, photographers, or even content creators. When it comes to the display, the M14 screen is fantastic. The panel is very bright with a decent brightness of about 280 nits, but you might have some issues if you love working outside under direct sunlight. The display is not as wide and bright as the one on the Zen screen, but it's comparable in terms of image quality. The ThinkVision measures 8.1 by 12.7 by 3.6 inches and weighs just about 1.3 pounds, making it extremely easy to carry around if you're someone who travels a lot. On top of that, the ThinkVision provides lots of different ports. In the M14's base, there are two USB-C ports plus arrow buttons to manually control the panel's brightness. Also, the M14 comes with a meter-long USB-C type cable that you can connect to a laptop and essentially have a portable dual monitor setup on the go. The M14 is also an incredibly sturdy display, as Lenovo used very high quality materials to make this robust display. Most portable monitors come with a fold-up case that is a hassle to bend, but the M14 has a strong built-in stand that also flips out for added weight and additional tilting options. In fact, you can extend the stand out from the display between negative 5 and 90 degrees tilt. Another great thing about the M14 is the affordable price, which is great if you need a quality portable monitor without spending too much. The M14 does everything right for an extremely compact and portable monitor that's ideal for both personal and professional use, thanks to its bright and crisp display. Next on my list is the ViewSonic VG1655, my choice for the best unique portable monitor. With its built-in stand, unique mini joystick controller, and spectacular display, the ViewSonic VG1655 is one of the best portable monitors. The ViewSonic measures 8.8 .8 by 14 by 0.6 inches, which makes this a great portable option, even though it's not as convenient to carry around as the ThinkVision. The ViewSonic is also one of the very few portable monitors to have a built-in stand, which is very useful if you travel often and you don't have too much space for your second monitor. Additionally, the portable monitor includes two USB C ports, one that supports data and video transfer, the other up to 60 watts of power delivery. On top of that, the ViewSonic also sports a mini HDMI port and an audio out jack for connecting your headphones. One of the most unique features of the ViewSonic is the incorporated five-way mini joystick controller to navigate through the menus. The mini joystick is located at the monitor's lower right corner back and it is essentially a four arrow button plus an enter button when you press the stick straight in. When it comes to the display, the ViewSonic is surprised surprisingly good, with fantastic brightness and vivid colors. As a typical IPS panel, the ViewSonic offers excellent viewing angles, and the brightness stands at 250 nits. 250 nits aren't mind-blowing, but it's more than enough for the average user and significantly higher than the Asus Zen screen's 180 nits of brightness. The ViewSonic will actually do a great job with casual video and photo viewing. Still, the limited color gamut and the subpar contrast could be a deal breaker for some professional video makers and photographers. ViewSonic's VG1655 is a great portable monitor with its lightweight and compactness. And on top of that, it also offers some unique features like the mini joystick, which makes it stand out from its competition. Next on my list, is the Asus ZenScreen MB16 AMT, my choice for the best overall portable monitor. Now, if you're looking for the best overall portable monitor, the Asus ZenScreen MB16 AMT is a spectacular device with built-in speakers, a responsive touchscreen, and premium build quality. The ZenScreen's touch measures 9 by 14.2 by 0.4 inches and has a premium silver gray aluminum chassis. The ZenScreen looks and feels premium with its luxurious case that 
that makes it stand out from other portable monitors, like the ViewSonic, which is mainly made out of plastic. The touchscreen is 15.6 inches, touch-sensitive 1080p IPS panel, and supports 10-point compactive multi-touch input, meaning that you can control it by using either the standard finger-based touch gestures such as stretching, pinching, or scrolling, or Asus also provides a stylus pen out of the box. The stylus is equipped with a soft eraser for scrolling, tapping on links, and other cool functions on one end. On the other end, it's an actual pen that you can write with on paper. Navigating through the menus is an absolute delight, thanks to its incredibly responsive touchscreen and precise stylus pen. Although Zen Screen's touchscreen is precise and responsive, it's not accurate enough for artists. So if you're looking for a portable monitor for your drawings, the Zen Screen won't cut it for you. One unique feature of the Zen Screen is that it has its own battery capacity. This is Quite unusual with portable monitors as they typically draw power from the computer or device they're connected to. The Zen Screen has a built-in 7800 mAh battery that can run up to 4 hours at full brightness. When it comes to panel quality, Asus Zen Screen's display is equipped with 240 nits of brightness and a great 1260 to 1 contrast ratio. Overall, the colors on the Zen Screen appear crisp and vivid. However, Due to limited color coverage, especially with reds and purples, it might not be the best choice for photographers and videographers. Asus's Zen Screen is the best overall portable monitor with its built-in battery, a premium aluminum build, and excellent display for productivity work. If you're interested in updated pricing on any of the items mentioned in this video, be sure to check out the links below. Prices update on these products almost daily with sales and general price drops, so if you want to find the most updated information, check the description. If you find this video helpful, please help out the channel by giving this video a like and subscribing. Next on my list is the Lapal C2S, my choice for the best affordable portable monitor. With its incredibly affordable price, the Lapal C2S is a portable monitor with a remarkable display for those who don't want to spend a lot on their second portable screen. When it comes to building quality, the Lapal is nowhere near what you get with the Asus Zen screen, but for the affordable cost, it is to be expected. The chassis of the Lapal is almost entirely plastic, but the portable monitor doesn't feel cheap at all to the touch. The portable monitor measures 8.9 by 14.6 by 0.3 inches and weighs 1.8 pounds, making it one of the lightest and most portable monitors to carry around. So if you're looking for an affordable and portable alternative, the Lapal is an excellent choice. A unique feature of the Lapal is its metal stand, which is fastened to both sides at the top of the monitor. When the stand is unfolded, you can adjust the screen tilt to as much as a 45 degree angle. Also, the stand feels exceptionally robust, and you won't need to worry about your lapel slipping or falling flat. Even though the lapel is a small monitor, it offers a generous amount of ports. In fact, it has two USB Type-C ports, one of which is just for powering the monitor, and the other is for receiving data and drawing power from the laptop. On top of that, the lapel also sports a mini HDMI port, a mini display port, and a headphone jack. The display on the Lapal is a 15.4 inch panel with a full HD resolution. Now, although the brightness isn't the best, especially when compared to the ThinkVision, it's still more than enough if you use it inside or in dark spaces. The monitor's brightness stands at 220 nits. While that isn't the highest brightness on the market for a portable monitor, the display's quality renders photos and videos nicely with its sharp colors. Overall, the Lapal is probably the best affordable portable monitor on the market with its remarkable panel, generous amount of ports, and sturdy metal stand. And the final item on my list is the Asus ZenScreen M. B16 AC, my choice for the best productivity portable monitor. The Asus ZenScreen MB16 AC is among the best portable monitors for productivity on the market with outstanding software and a fantastic display. The screen is a 15.6 inch with a resolution of 1080p and a brightness of 179.6 nits. The colors on the MB16 are vivid and clear. However, the low brightness is a bit of a letdown. If you love working outside under direct sunlight, the MB16 is not a good choice for you. And the portable monitor with higher nit values such as the Lenovo ThinkVision is a much better option. Colors on the MB16 are great as they cover 72.4% of the sRGB color gamut. To put that into perspective, 100% is about ideal. And it has a color accuracy of 0.2. The closer to zero, the better for color accuracy. The MB16 is an incredibly portable monitor that measures 14.6 by 8.9 by 0.3 inches and weighs just about 2.8 pounds. That includes the cover. There's no built-in hinge like the lapel as the MB16's cover 
is foldable and it actually acts as a stand too. Regarding design, Asus never fails to impress with the premium materials used. The MB16 has an aluminum gray back that makes it look like an expensive piece of gear and it also makes the portable monitor very sturdy. As for the software, the MB16 is almost unbeatable if you're looking for a serious productivity enhancer device. For example, there's a four level blue light filter for working at night and a series of optimized modes for reading and working. Display Widget is another handy software for productivity. It lets you change all the settings you want with a single click without going through endless menus, like with most portable monitors. So if you're looking for the best portable monitor to enhance your productivity, you can't go wrong with the Asus ZenScreen MB16AC. If you guys like this video or learned something, please give it a like. And be sure to check out the description for links to find the most up-to-date pricing on all products mentioned in this video. That's all. Till next time.